But in some good news, though, there's a tiny bird giving researchers some really big clues on how climate change is impacting the most vulnerable of species. And the findings offer hope that living beings can adapt. Keely Chalmers explains. This is the southwestern willow flycatcher. It's a federally endangered bird, and it is giving researchers a never before seen glimpse into how animals are adapting to a changing climate. Climate change is, is threatening the ability of organisms to survive and reproduce, and it's even driving some species to the brink of extinction. Sheila Turbeck is a researcher in the Department of Biology at Colorado State University. She led a study on how the endangered bird is evolving in the face of climate change and a changing southwestern habitat. And these are areas that are predicted to get a lot hotter and potentially more humid um, as climate change continues. Uh, so this is a bird that could face climate-induced extinction. So how does one determine if an animal is adapting over the span of a century? You go back to the museum to start. The researchers compared the DNA in 100 plus old museum specimens to present bird specimens. Looking at the genetic material, the researchers discovered the bird's genes had mutated. I was really surprised, to be honest. Um, basically, these birds are um, changing their DNA sequences in order to better cope with wetter, more humid conditions in Southern California. Conditions that weren't before, but are now common in Southern California. Even more surprising, how quick the birds adapted. We usually think of evolution happening over millions of years. So the fact that we can detect this evolutionary response over a century um, is pretty cool. Knowledge that can help us better predict what's going to happen in the future and how species might evolve to survive. Our results provide really critical information about the pace of adaptation to climate change in wild populations that can help us better predict how species will respond to environmental change going into the future. Keely Chalmers, Nine News. Turbeck says if animals don't adapt, they will have to move to a different region where they're better suited for the weather and the terrain. If they don't, they risk going extinct.